<laughs> oh, shit. I got education, though. Okay, then. Oh, well, at least it's okay. You're okay, boy. How you doing? You all right? You doing all right? No, but no, that's what I. That's what I was waiting on. I was like, oh fuck, maybe I should pause this in case his audio is included. Hey, okay. Adelante's on. Oh. Yeah. Is it? But he never includes his audio because he's. <laughs> Still playing fucking that game. Uh, Mass Effect, I love that game. Uh, I've met some people who play it. Yeah. It's probably his brother. Only you. Didn't I already fucking do this? I added his brother. Damn it, where the fuck's going? I thought we had. Oh, we were going to, but he took way too long. And then Harvey's online playing multiplayer. I get a fucking party invite. He didn't join our. I joined your party. That should be something. Wait, hold on. When did you change your name to party? I mean, Harvey. <laughs> party Harvey. Harvey's the name of Maddie's cousin's boyfriend. Oh. Okay, he sounds like yeah. a real winner. Easy. <laughs> Well, uh, his gamer tag is Harvey Davis is zero one two three. Mm. Sounds like a real winner. <laughs> I can make fun of uh, that gamer tag, but I'll I'll avoid doing it. We get along. Well. I like the guy. 
I don't like the guy and I don't even know him. <laughs> <laughs> She. Yeah. Do you smoke, sir? Sure, but perhaps not as much as you. Oh, <laughs> no, oh don't worry about these. Actually, well, take some. Take a couple. God, of every take time. Oh, thank you. She what has are dinner. Cigarettes for? Are you and no, she doesn't. She just doesn't want to be party with no, you. No, 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 nothing like that. <laughs> I'm just interested no, she, in cards. It's at her uh, okay. grandma's house. Cigarette cards. Oh, you got any? Yeah. Well, they do this like every Sunday. Like practically every Sunday. Ah, nothing I haven't got. Remember when he said on the seventh day, day, let there be rest? Well, when he 200 made the seventh day, day, just so I can keep very I, uh, already I had I the fucking the tuna casserole coming out of the oven. Just saying. These babies. Like, sure. like well, every is, uh, Sunday. Tuna casserole in the oven? Yeah, it is. Not to mention the vast yeah. amounts of life reaffirming you cigarettes I get to smoke. Don't you cook tuna casserole? And the amount of money. No, I don't know. Tuna casseroles are cold Oh, sure, sure. What is it? It's a complete set of any series. It's a casserole. Is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Over here? Circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, you, you meow meows of the desert. So rare. Oh, that's a tuna salad. How much? Well, oh, it depends that's on the right rarity, right. sir. Oh, <laughs> I thought about you that. I'm like, get a what? Complete set, I what can, would uh, be take cold? Hands. That would be you very similar me. to a tuna oh, casserole. Tuna salad. Hey, you send them to me right here. Phineas All of you guys watching that at home, you have just been educated. Okay, I gotta run. Oh, this is my throw. casserole <laughs> and a <laughs> salad. Okay, think about this deal. I don't Dude, know about that. Really set. <laughs> <laughs> <That's where the laughs> <bad box. laughs> we still don't know how to toss make your them, casserole, though, but you know the difference. <laughs> what? <laughs> can I toss your casserole? No, but you can toss my salad. <laughs> I don't want to do the salad. <laughs> Would you ever refer to a woman's part as that? To the salad? Okay, boy. If I had, I had the lettuce and like threw it at it, but I probably wouldn't do that in the first place, so I don't know. <laughs> I need more greens in my diet. I want your salad. Mm -hmm. Alright, boy. That'd be a terrible. So. Like some of it, the girl getting uh, hey, like lettuce leaves or a spinach leaves tattooed down there, just for that expression. I don't uh, know if it'd be worth it. Hey, I heard you want to eat healthy. Would you like some salad? <laughs> oh shit! Wait, wait what? <laughs> no, I would not. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about this. Cause that style doesn't have enough sausage. <laughs> I just ate a can of baked beans. Mm. Yummy, yummy. <laughs> yummy, yummy in my tummy. And I just watched a video that Jason uh, shared. Spoiler? I can... Yeah, it was a spoiler, and David, it only confirmed how yeah, I. Yeah, told me about that. Well, like he, he watched a video from Jason. And uh, there was a spoiler in it. He's like, you know, you should probably never watch any of his videos. Yeah. Not until you beat in the game, which is gonna be. I'm still in chapter two. Yeah, I'm still in chapter two as well. I keep fucking around now. <laughs> right. Yeah. I haven't really been pay playing it lately. I've been doing homework, and then I've been playing Call of Duty. I don't think I played a game this single player this much since Destiny and Halo Reach before that. Will you hurry up and pet my horse? Oh, um, I'm not in your game, David. Are you seem in a good mood. I am, son. I am. <laughs> Let's have some fun. David. What's up? Enjoy ourselves. I was just thinking of uh, the Stealth Park episode where uh, Hartman's a um, Yelp reviewer and uh, that kid, David, or well, he said it was David, uh, the kid David. I was just thinking about that for no particular reason. I don't remember that episode, sorry. 
really. Yeah. Yep. Good boy. Hmm. It's a shame. It was kind of funny. How many bottles of whiskey can I drink before I pass out? It's two. I'm starting to feel something. If you can down an entire fifth of, of uh, whiskey. Would I? I'm just saying, I'm having Arthur drink a lot of whiskey right now. A fifth of whiskey isn't really that much. For you? I'm like a fucking lightweight, remember? That's, that's right. Ah, I always miss the initial fucking pop. I used to be so much better at this. I got a white screen. Screen's getting foggy. Oh Ooh. shit, she probably stopped. I uh, should probably stop. I have to replenish my cores because I drank so much whiskey it started to kill me. What's that? Ha! <laughs> Still got you. Fuck you. Dear Arthur, I've written this letter a hundred times. I've almost never run into enemy trip lines. Right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke and I was going off to get married that we would not speak again. Mary I know Linton. I said a lot of things and I meant them, I suppose, oh, man. at the time. But I'm not so proud Dude, as to sex. Not speak I want grocery shopping. Care for me or cared for me. I didn't pick up a single a fucking snack for, for myself. Months. I had some didn't pick up a single what? Bad luck. Snack. Well, I, I thought you said snake. I was like, what? Not an what are you doing with one? snakes? But I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran Girls is a polite term for girls, right? Town, and I heard say it again? Of a man who sounded like girls me. is a polite way to say I girls, would love right? To see you again. Girls? If you could spare me a little bit of yeah. your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, saw, uh, just north of Valentine. Sentence here Yours, from a letter reading. Mary Linton. She says, uh, I saw a couple of girls, or whatever the polite term is for them. She was talking about the yeah, girls, girls that you ride in the bathroom. <laughs> the girls that you ride in the bathroom? Did you just say that? No, ride, uh, <laughs> ride into Valentine with. Uh, oh, oh, oh. I think girls is the uh, appropriate way of saying it. You're a rat boy. What's John want? Mr. Marston. You did good with Sean. You wouldn't have got him without you. All we seem to do is rescue folks these days, Arthur. Hey, Arthur! <laughs> You know, Jason kind of looks like John want? Marston. Uncle told me something about a train. <sighs> what did he say? Mary Beth overheard something about a train. I kind of see that. Folk rolling down through Scarlet Meadows, just south of the I've seen it in a while, but yes. like, you need help with it? I, I ain't to, even to sure I'm doing it. Come on, at night, not too guarded. It's perfect. Nah, I ain't thought it through. <sighs> you know, stopping a train, pain in the ass. Sure. Man, I would but really love some sour cream and cheddar fucking ruff train ruffles right stopped. now. Well, of course. We get a wagon full of something flammable. 
I bet you would. Put it on the tracks. They see it. They got to stop or die. Ain't no train driver wants to be cooked alive. Yeah, I finally found it. Oh, oh, fucking stupid ass cool. Kind of brilliant. Uh, for you. <laughs> and that is a real idea. I think that's the first time you ever had one of them. <laughs> Shut up. You might be the first bastard to ever have half his brains eaten by a wolf and end up more intelligent. So we're doing it? Yeah, we're gonna need ammunition, guns, look real frightening, and some dynamite to open up the train. I'll get the supplies. Gotta head into town for Abigail anyway. Don't even ask. You go find us an Don't old even ask. Yeah, I know just the place. They're always heading into that refinery. There's an old rundown shack just over the border, north of a place called Dewberry Creek. Leave it hidden somewhere near there. John Marston gets I just watched a nomad around. die because a uh, dog killed him. That's kind of funny. A nomad. My God, what did I drink last night? Son of a bitch. Uh, so a nomad is a uh, character in this game that can summon a dog. The only character. And then I watched a nomad on the enemy team get killed by a dog. Don't forget to go hunting, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, I hear you. Damn it, Sean. God damn it. I can't even fucking... I can't even get a kill without fucking getting shot from the side or behind. Morning, Arthur. Hey, Tilly. Hey. You recover from Sean's party? Yeah. Don't know if he has. Well, I suppose I should be getting on. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. See you later. Can I get some stew? I actually died from a fucking trip line. That has Whatever. happened very, very little. We had three people at AFK. Some bullshit. I just watched somebody get the play of the game by killing the three people who weren't present. That were just standing in the back. I don't know if it's on my team or not, but I'm about to check. Yeah, three people from our team just like sitting there. And then they just killed them all. Sure. Anything fun? Man, the more I think about it, the more I want I've been bad. fucking I've been food. Killing animals just for the hell of it. Uh -huh. Maybe well, I should uh, order a pizza. I got the money. Also killed a bunch of innocent folk. Why didn't you get any snacks then? What's wrong with you? I just get so angry about everything, about how this is gonna end. <laughs> Well, if you got the cheddar, how come you didn't get sour cream? Keep your mind, you? Arthur. <laughs> <laughs> no. I know. I'm gonna look at food apps, see what I wanna fucking get, see what I can use as pay on delivery. Just be mindful of how much you spend it. It's next up on you. Yeah, I know. I'm aware. Yep. Hey. Study you. And I'm gonna study Brown Jack. And I'm gonna study Neil a second. And I'm gonna. And I'm gonna. And I'm gonna. Fucking! The count! Thank you. I'm gonna study the count. And then we're gonna, um. Steal a wagon real quick. I forgot I make a I gotta get closer. Is 
force isn't very fast. I've ultimately decided that this game is a cinematic camera horse rider simulator version 2. Point three. Oh yeah, since it is the third game in the series, Red Dead series. Yeah. Just sitting there the entire time he had. What the fuck? I've been over there for a couple minutes. Never did I see that guy. I think I got away. So if my horse is out in the wild, I can call him from the stable, right? Yeah. Make sure. Why is it yeah. so fucking hard with sniping right now? It used to be pretty good. I think it's because I'm not playing so much like a sniper. I'm also laying down on my side right now. I'm almost afraid to go back to a Call of Duty game. At the skill level I left off at. Upper fucking torso shot. Where's that horse going to? Oh, that would have killed her if I just fucked that armor. Yep. Roadkill. Terrible. 
We're playing team deathmatch or that blackout game mode? Team deathmatch. Hmm. Yeah. Kinda wanna go back to Call of Duty, but I'm afraid uh, I might get my ass handed to me. <laughs> uh, it's actually pretty good. I like it. We haven't been no, I meant World War II. Oh. oh, that game. Yeah, it's actually a lot of fun. I like it. And there's a lot more people that are a little better than me than they used to be, but that's mainly my fault. I'm very at practice. anything. <sighs> Eden just wants to fucking argue about everything. At least she's more useful than Grandma and Mom, though. Ah, that's terrible. I feel like you this don't is get... really personal. Yeah, some of it is. The overall problem is it. Fucking stupid. Grandma's super slow to pack. I'm good for moving stuff. Packing. That's. I can pack. I try to pack quite a few boxes. But like personal stuff, what goes where, clothes. I don't know what to do with that shit. She was supposed to take care of that. She's had over a month to do it. She's, I think she's had over two months. She waited till the last fucking second to start doing anything. Mm. Yeah. Some people just get stuck in the pity me, oh, what was me, my life sucks phase, and they don't do anything about it. It's annoying. Especially when it inconveniences others. Specifically me. I wonder what's in this building over here. Another building. Wait, what? Yeah, he makes uh, miniature models. Nope, can't go inside. No, 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 he wants to protect his miniature models. Did you not hear what I just said? He obviously put a fair bit of importance on them. Why would he just let you walk in? Some people just never listen. <laughs> I listen. Shut up. <laughs> Why don't you pull that mask down before you do any business here? Black Ops oh, season yeah, pass probably... is way too expensive. Probably do that. I'm gonna walk into pain spray. <laughs> so just remember, if you ever lose your if you ever lose your horse, but it's not dead, I don't know if what it will happen if it's dead. But you can go to um, Los Santos Customs and get it back. Pro tip. Pro tip. Sure, I can work with a nag like this. We call it a nag. That's really mean. You know, a horse can tell when you're using a cheaper son. Didn't you oh, use like zombies? Can I? I can't remember. Yeah, back when it was good. Oh, snap! I it's actually there. still pretty good. That was a good one. I have to give you that. But it actually is still good. I, I personally like it where it's at right now. I like the, uh... I like Black Ops 2? Because it seemed like the... Well, I like Black Ops 2 as well because uh, the maps seemed a little more fun. Yeah. But I liked where World War 2 kind of did its thing with, uh... Oh, I guess I already purchased that. So... <laughs> 
Allow me to explain but, uh, to you a little bit about what's going on. Oh, sorry, you finish, and then I'll do that. Oh, I was just saying that uh, World War Two seemed to have a uh, story, a story driven to uh, which we call it. It's or like an objective you can actually win. You don't just get it a little better every time. Oh yeah, in the original one. I can't tell you how many times. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm good. So um. For this one, it continues the storylines uh, for a few different ones. It's not just one storyline um, like there was previously. There's uh, mm -hmm. the chaos story, as they call it, which is um, the, the actors. No, no, not the actors. The woman. I don't know. It's just, it's just one of them. Uh, and then there's the... Uh, Storyline, the Aether storyline, which is from, um, you know, Nikolai and them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's their story. So it continues that one. Oh, okay. And, uh, so there's those two different storylines. And, uh, you know, the other stuff that's gonna come out with, uh, DLC or whatever, but, um, ooh, hiccup. So it has all those. Yeah. And, um, the way the zombies works, uh, in terms of like what you can do, uh, so they got rid of um, having like four or five whatever grenades. They got rid of it completely. Mm -hmm. It's not a thing. Instead, what happens is you get three of it, and um, it regenerates over time. And, but you can only have a max of three. Um, also, you can change the that that's your equipment. So you can change it and create a class. Um, so you can create a class for this one. I don't know if you can do that for you, but you can now. What you can change is your starting weapon, your equipment, and your special weapon, aka your ultimate mm -hmm. ability. Your ultimate ability has four choices, um, and each storyline has different uh, ultimate weapons. But other than the ultimate weapon, in terms of create a class. Both stories are the exact same. They each have perks, they each have their equipment that are the same, and then they also have the elixirs, which I'll explain later. So, okay. uh, your special weapons, there's four of them. Uh, usually they're offensive oriented, so I think one or two of them out of the eight total are uh, not specifically meant for offense exclusively. Uh, but they're very useful, and they can really get you out of a jam. And they regenerate. Once you use it, it's slow, but they it'll come back over time. Killing may or may not do them along. And just like uh, Max Ammo, there's a drop that a silver drop with two swords that zombies will do that will give you back your um, your your ultimate ability. It'll just charge it all the way up, and it levels up as you use it in game. So it'll always be level one zero XP when you uh, start a game. And, and then it can get all the way up to tier 3, or level 3 whatever. Under a shirt, the idiot. Um, so that's pretty cool. So you, you don't want to just save it the entire game. You want to try and use it once or twice in the beginning, uh, try and level it up. So anywho, um, they're pretty cool. They're pretty cool. Uh, so then, for, in terms of equipment, of course you got to level up in order to unlock uh, the different equipment. Uh, you start off with frag grenades. The next one's an acid bomb, which is pretty much a, uh, a semitex. Very useful. I have it equipped currently. Very useful. Then you can get claymores at level 22 that you can place down. And I'm sure you've used them before. Then there's this thing called yeah. the Fra Wraith Fire. Blue alchemical flame that burns unnatural terrors, but not people. So it's basically a napalm that won't hurt you or your friends. And uh, then at level 46, you can unlock a sentry turret, and it'll uh, it'll target and harass nearby enemies with a barrage of low damage shots, which is pretty good. It, it can be considered a monkey, I think, that also shoots, so that it probably doesn't blow up. I'm not sure, but like that's what I'm thinking. So those are the equipment you can come in the game with, it'll, and they'll regenerate over time. Uh, starting weapons, you can have the standard uh, eight chamber uh, revolver. Uh, there's a semi-automatic pistol called the Strife. Uh, more damage than the than the revolver, which is kind of weird, but whatever. Uh, then the three-round burst pistol, uh, which is 
pretty good. Um, and then you can also have the pump action shotgun uh, straight out the gate. You can also have the uh, model model 07 uh, lever action tactical rifle. Pretty useful. It's usually like one of the first one of those first two weapons, like the M1 grind that's available in the previous ones. And if you reach level 44. Uh, you have to be 50 for the shotgun, by the way. If you reach level 44, you can start off with a full automatic submachine gun. The saw uh, gun. Just... Uh, Alright, sorry. Uh, some guys were talking ill at me. I had to set them straight. Nice, nice. <laughs> Alright, so then, in terms of perks, uh, Juggernaut's no longer a perk. Oh. It's no longer a thing. S instead, what's going on is, by default, y you have four bars of health. Or four, sa four sections of your health bar, basically. And so if you get hit four times, you'll go down. Um, hmm. Always. And it'll regenerate back. Quick revive makes it regenerate faster and it less delay. Um, so yeah, they had the new perks of course, but that one should that one's good. Um, also, you can no longer uh, you no longer have access to all of the perks um, in the game. You have access to the four, which you choose in creative class, um, and they'll appear wherever you want. And by that, I mean there's four altars or four stone machines, if you will. In any mm -hmm. game, the altars are for chaos. Aether with Dempsey and them is soda machines. So any, so you get to pick which altar has which perk. And if you put it at the last altar, which is usually the one that takes longest to get to, usually, um, you'll get a secondary modifier if you go and get it, um, which is dependent on each perk. Like, uh, let's choose. Let's look at Dying Wish. Dying Wish is, a, I think, a new. Um, instead of entering last stand uh, when you get knocked down, uh, the player goes berserk for nine seconds. While berserk, they are invulnerable, and melee damage is greatly increased. Afterwards, the player is left with one health, and cooldown increases with every use. So there's a cooldown time every time you use it. Uh, the modifier is that the player will receive full health when no longer. So if you wait till the last one, and you get that one, uh, then you, uh, you get rid of that. <laughs> Stuff like that. Um, you can pick four. There's about two, four, five, six, four, thirteen perks, and then there's a, another perk that just gives you a random perk. So you can say, mm -hmm. I don't really know what I want here. Or even if I do, like, I just, I just want it to be random. And so, you know, make Game type or whatever, I guess. So those are the perks. And then with the elixirs, you can have four elixirs which are mapped to uh, the, your D-pad. Um, and the way they work is you have the classic ones, which you have to unlock as you level up. Uh, which the highest is technically 39, but for practicality it's 35. And you'll get all of the classic ones. Um, and, uh, then there's common, rare, legendary, and epic, which for some reason legendary is not the last one. That's kind of weird. Uh, but anywho, um, uh, what's it called? Yeah, so those ones are consumable. So if you use them once, you lose one. So you gotta fight, mm -hmm. you gotta get more. Uh, which, there's a system to doing that. Uh, so then, uh, like I got, th I have three rare ones. And four common ones, but I don't use them. I'll just collect them uh, for now, unless we're trying to get an achievement or something. So anyways, uh, there's uh, 5, 10, 15 classic ones, technically 14. One's a whimsical one, so I'm not really counting it. Um, and they can be like, always done swiftly, instant activation. Uh, so if you hit, if you equip it and you hit the D-pad direction, you'll pull out the elixir and drink it. And for five minutes, uh, you will walk faster while aiming. Raise and lower your weapon to uh, aim more quickly. 
So I get like more of the game faster. Let's see like that. Or anywhere but here. This one's very useful and you get it at, like at level one. Instantly teleport to a random location. A concussive blast knocks away any nearby zombies, keeping you safe. So like you need to get the fuck out. Do it. Um Burned out. The next time you uh take a melee damage after um or no no. Once you drink it. For the next three times you take melee damage, nearby zombies will burst into flames. So, like, shit like that. Nowhere but here. Sounds... Unlock this one. So, it sounds yeah. very arcadey. Uh, well, you, you, you create the class, so, like, this is, these are... It's a little bit right. more arcadey. It's not as serious. Uh, but then again, ever since Black Ops 2... Uh, arguably Black Ops 1 because of the voice line uh, options. Uh, it, it's not exactly been as serious as it was in World uh, World at War. So this is kind of like, um, oftentimes I forget to use these things, but um, like these things are pretty useful. Now, uh, Newtonian negation, the whimsical uh, uh, one, I agree, that is uh, that Dark 80. Uh, for 25 minutes, zombies that are killed will fall straight up. So that one is, uh, that one is supposed to be silly. Uh, but like, it's a, a way to change the game up a bit. Like, the epic ones, uh, one of the epic ones, uh, is Cashback. Spawns a max ammo power up. Uh, but again, what, you can only equip, I think, one at a time. And you could, every time you use one, it consumes one. So it's really hard to get epic, uh, epic. Uh, join the party. All players in spectate will spawn in immediately. That's pretty cool. Uh, wall power. Auto activates on your next wall by gun purchase. The next gun bought off the wall comes pack a punch. So those are the three epic tier uh, elixirs. And whenever you use one, not when you bring it into a game, but just whenever you use it, it's consumed. Um, and there's legendary and rare and common. Of course, they get less and less powerful as you go back. Um, but still very useful. Like in common, there's a dead of nuclear winter. It spawns a nuke power up. Very useful. Um, but of course, you have to hit the button, drink it, and then activate it. So there's a delay. So it's not you just tap it and it does it. There's a certain amount of timing involved. Mm -hmm. But uh, so that that just you know adds extra abilities and stuff like that, which is kind of cool. Again, it technically is a little bit more arcadey, but like I don't think they did negatively right on that. Uh, this zombies have been getting more and more ridiculous since. Uh, it's, Black Ops 1. Um, oh. It's just been gradual. Now we're at Black Ops 4. It's, but it's not, it's not unreasonable. They do have, um, they do have. I think it's called arcade mode in this one. Uh, but before I tell you about that, let me just tell you about the last aspect of the creative class, which is talismans. Talismans, you can only attach, equip one at a time, and. Like elixirs, they are consumed. However, unlike elixirs, if you equip the talisman, it uses it at the beginning of the game. So it's auto in effect. Like I have one that's major amulet of the third circle, which is a, a rare one. You don't, you, it doesn't give you any talismans. There's no um, regular ones that you can use infinitely. Right. At the start of the game, uh, or start the game with the Zeus slash Soda Dirt. Now, what that means is, um, there's Danu, Ra, Zeus, and Odin. Those are the four, uh, the four perks. Um, and that's the order in which they appear, the area in which they appear, whatever. So I have quick, I have, um, a perk called Strong, or some called Stronghold on the Zeus area. Um, so if I use that uh, talisman, I'll start the game with Stone Cold Stronghold. Now, uh, in the Aether story, instead of them all being soda machines, for the differentiation of um, the different perks, they have the Brew Machine, the Cola, the Soda, and the Tonic Machine. 
And so the soda, which is that one, I have this part called time slip terminated, which is equipment cooldown rates increased. So you get them back faster. Mystery box and pack punch mm -hmm. weapons appear faster and greatly reduce trap and fast travel cooldowns. So that's pretty useful. Oh yeah, uh, when you drink an elixir, although one is consumed, if you have more, or uh, if they're the ones that can be used infinitely, um, they will slowly regenerate over time. Like, I'm talking multiple rounds. Okay. I never even saw one fully regenerate. I just noticed that there was uh, some of the elixir coming back. Right. Which is why it says every time you use one, it's consumed. Not every time you uh, bring it into the game. Or, uh, you know, whatever. That would be pretty cool if you could only use one per game. And after that, it's just... If you survive long enough to use again, it wouldn't pull it from the pool. But that's not the way it is. But yeah, so that's the way the pack or the uh, creative class works. You have to create your Aether story and Chaos story um, setup separately. So if you want the exact same setup for uh, both of them, give or take the special weapon, you just gotta go and mm -hmm. make it the same. Which makes sense, cause mainly because of this, the special weapons. And you can unlock more uh, creative class. Uh, Things you as you level up. Hello? You a bounty hunter? Well, not right now, I ain't. You Black Bell? I'd like to so talk like, to uh, you about to your To get all of them, days. you gotta be like level 43 or something. Care much for reminiscing. You got any friends as bounty hunters? None I think I'm on level away from getting another one. But yeah. So, in order to make potions and talismans, uh, or to attain them, I should say. There's this thing called the laboratory. Uh, it's right next to create a class, and then you have options to concoct. Uh, it, it costs um, potions, basically. It's like these potion bottles. They're, the, they're what you use to create it. And you earn them by playing the game. So when you do a zombie smash, me and Devontae uh, was, uh, got an achievement last night, getting to wave 20 without leaving the starting area for, uh, for one of the maps. Took us a couple of attempts uh, we while we were learning here. some. We learned some life, really interesting stuff liberty. about it, but uh, nonetheless, mm -hmm. so we did that. I think we got like nine or ten uh, potions after we uh, died on wave twenty twenty one, uh, to getting trapped. Um, and so, we, yeah, we got about ten, maybe twelve potions. Um, so as you keep playing more and more rounds, getting higher waves, you get more potions each time, uh, you can eventually come to the laboratory, and you have currently three options. I don't know if they'll increase it in the future, but for now, at least we have three options. You can spend 30 potions, and you'll get three random elixirs, so it's going to be a heavy thing, but of course the uh, lower grade elixirs are still the stack against the higher grade. And you also have a chance of the talisman. So there's a possibility you'll just get a talisman out of it. You can spend 45 in your guaranteed one rare or better elixir, along with two random elixirs and a chance of a talisman. And then one second, and then there's, there's the third option, 75. You're guaranteed one rare or better elixir, two random elixirs, and you're also guaranteed a shooting my hat. So basically, you're spending an extra 30 for a year. Well, the way I see it. What's up? Oh, thank you. Yeah. So that's that's the way that the getting elixirs system. Keep buying 45s and 75s. Maybe you even get lucky on a 30. But eventually, maybe get a. Uh, <laughs> You'll maybe eventually get a higher level. What? Sorry, I am listening. I'm just on the Oh, yeah. Okay. I got you. But yeah, if you decide to get it, I'm greatly enjoying this game. And Wante enjoys the game as well. He only has to, to like, on Red Dead to enjoy this game. Which I'm not playing. Oh, yeah, we're and he's also been spoiled by yeah. Battlefield. You got damn scalp hunters uh, off Which is For really now. good. But. So, yeah, you gonna tell me I about your you. Wild West days? I've been playing a lot of this when I have time. Callaway. Little boy Callaway? Mm. <laughs> the only runner he did was away from a fight. I will be back. And that's about the end of it. Uh, 
man's apparently a famous gunslinger. Yeah, so they say. But, uh, don't get what's famous confused with what's true. The ones of us that lived that life, we was too busy being scared for our scalp to talk to no newspaper writers or dime novel men. Well, what were they like then? Those days they all talk about. <sighs> Same as now, I guess. Only longer ago. <laughs> all right. I'm gonna need your picture, too, if it ain't a trouble. No, sir, no trouble at all. Can't be worse than those awful drawings on the wanted posters. <laughs> Hell, great. Well, you stand over there and... Oh, let me get this thing ready. Uh, ready? How do you want it? Like this? Okay, I got it. Well, I guess I'll be on my way. Here. <laughs> well, thank you, Mrs. Bell. You gonna be all right? Oh, been running for 20 years. Suppose I'll be running till I drop. Just the way it is. Yeah. Good luck. <laughs> hey, she stayed alive. Cool. I loot all these guys, and then I gotta get my hat. Fucking law shows up. Come on. Get faster. Come on, noise in my effects, please. And my hat. Fucking suffered too much at the hands of this fucking. What the hell? At the hand of that thing in order not to have my hat. Damn, bear cost me everything. Am I too hot? Gold pocket watch. Oh, it's fucking 85 degrees, holy shit. I don't have an outfit for this one. Right, when did I take off my hat? Yep. Commodore Norton, my fucks, please. And my hat. Commodore. What's that? Pleasant. Uh, death. Okay. 
Okay. You gonna help me? I need a doctor. You gotta. You gotta. You gotta hurry up and tell me what you need, or. Um. Um. Please. Please do something. Try not to bleed on me. Oh. All right, buddy. Don't die. This is it. Moving as fast as I can, bud. Right here. And sit him down in this chair. <coughs> what happened? Just saw you fall out of the saddle. Don't worry. You're at the doctor. Thanks, friend. I appreciate it. Sure. There's also the matter of my payment. But we'll deal with that later. All right. All right. A lot of blood loss. And this wound's badly infected. Ah! I'll save as much as I can, but I'll have to amputate. What? What did you say? Just try to breathe. Uh, it means you can't masturbate with your left hand. Give me something for the pain. No. Uh, there ah! you are. And I'll knock him out for a while. You did a good thing bringing him I... here. Get away from now, the front door. I'd recommend moving along. <clears throat> you do not want to see this. Sorry, it's come to this. Ah, oh, Jesus. Oh, are you done? Every little squish. Wow. Get ready. Get ready. Uh. Get out of bed. Uh, you just... You're pretty handy, Doc. <laughs> Are you talking to yourself? Right, sorry, this is serious. I don't know. Yeah, I just listened to a doctor fucking. <laughs> Pull through. I just listened to a doctor fucking cut off a guy's arm, and you can hear every fucking, uh. That was good work, doctor. Uh, that's probably... He's lucky. Wounds like that will kill what? you if you aren't careful. Mom's fully dressed. She's talking to Grandma right now. Yeah, I mean, I gotta get ready, too, but it only takes me a minute or two. Don't fret. 
I can play a game of Call of Duty, get ready, and we'd probably be tied. Alright. Alright. Bye. All we can do now is hope for the best. Right. That's fine. You don't have to quantify it. You don't have to quantify it. It's cool. Just make it a casual comment. Quantify is good. What do you want me to do? Uh, this is the place. I'm good. Saloon. Right. Bye. poster. Dominoes, all fives. Show. So, uh, to quantify is... something is to, um... Shit, I'm losing my words. Um, is to give dimensions to something. So if I told you, um, shit, why am I losing my words right now? Hold on, I gotta sit down. I was doing three things at once. Uh, You're all right, boy. You're okay, boy. Fuck, I keep drawing a blank. I got halfway there and then I just forgot what I was thinking about. So like, um... We were talking if, about uh, quantifying. Yeah. Or quantifying something is to, uh... Give dimensions. Give an un Or explain. Expand upon the understanding or definition. Uh, so, um... If I told you, uh... I had some change in my pocket, you want it? Uh... And then you said, no thank you. Because you thought it was a few pennies. Uh, this isn't the best example. Technically, this is uh, accurate usage. But uh, I could say, let me quantify this. The amount of change in my pocket is equal to five dollars. You may change your mind and say, oh, well, now that there's uh, uh, clearly defined dimensions of what this change is, maybe I want it now. Does that help at all? It's kind of out there. A little bit. Yeah, yeah so. Yeah, so it's it's kind of like explaining something, uh, bringing things that weren't, you know, previously being thought of to light, thought it was low, it was actually high for change in somebody's pocket, it goes at least. Or if, like, you saw a, uh, what was it? No, I'm just gonna stop on, not ahead. <laughs> Man, I'm hungry. I need a bath. <sighs> Made it all the way to this nice saloon. Mm -hmm. But they're like, you gotta dress nicer, cause you don't, you don't look the part. I tell you what. I gotta take off all these clothes and yeah. scrub my head. Probably gonna shave while I'm here. Who <sighs> would enjoy that? <sighs> I'm gonna get off. Need some help in here? I get ready to go try and move my ground yeah, for me. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Want me to kick you from the party? Or, you know, that way you don't disrupt uh, your stream? No, just go ahead and keep... Keep the party open? Alright. Yeah, you, so. Smell you later. Unless I'm congested. Ha 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 ha. Alright, bye. Ain't a woman here do a better job than me. Who uh, don't like strangers much in this town? Yeah, that's the new normal in these parts. <sighs> you gotta treat yourself sometimes, I reckon. That's for certain. Oh, I'm glad of this. Been a hard few days. Oh, interesting. I got the deluxe pass. Breathe real slow. It'll help you slow down. All right, that's perfect. Thanks. You take care of yourself, all right? I feel better. I feel better about myself. 
Excuse me, partner. Bonjour. It's not a bad town you got here. Well, anyway, all the best. I une prochaine fois. What's your problem? Let me tell you. Good to see you, man. Ain't you a sweet boy? I'll give you one. Hey, folks. Hey, you know Is the circus in Hi town? There. Howdy, big boy. Hello, mister. Yeah, bonjour. Take your time, take your time. Can I get a room for tonight, please? Okay, room is all set. Just head upstairs when you're ready. My apologies. How you do? Be careful. Hey, easy. There's no running Hello. in this. Hello, sir. Careful. No shit. I feel like this was a waste of a dollar. Ah, oh, sweet. Oh wait, I need a coat. I don't understand. Whatever, we'll do a store. That on a horse. Chaps my ass. Sometimes you just gotta... 
Rest your little eyes. You know? There we go. Now, there's things I want to do here. Talk to this stranger! Taylor. A newsman. A newspaper. A trapper. There you go, oh, friend. Bless you, mister. Truly, you're a saint. <laughs> yes, sir. There should be more people in the world like you. God bless. I really take his money, but they're throwing not a lot, a lot down there, so. Just leave the old guy alone. If there's only fancy clothes in this book, I'm gonna be pissed. Oh, fans. The Saint Dennis. 100 bucks. Nope, that's not what I wanted you to zoom in on. The Duvel. Please peruse at your leisure. I carry only the finest items. Mm -hmm. Well, you won't know for sure until you try it on. There are a few colors you can go with for this one. Yeah, but you don't have any dark colors. I'm looking for like black or dark gray. Or maybe really, really, really dark white. That Ooh, like is that. a local favorite. Thanks. I just went no shopping. No problem. And no, I'm a scumbag. If you change your mind, it'll be here well, Thank you. In. Look out! What am I? Invisible? You really don't have to answer that question. Excuse me, sir. Can I bother you for a minute of your time? All right. Can I tell you a little yeah. about what we're doing here? Sure. Less than a minute, I promise. Uh, we're trying to raise okay. money to build an expansion to the Quincy Harris Memorial Hall, a shelter for homeless veterans and their families. Can you help? A donation of $20 would put us well on our way. Hmm. Whatever. Twenty dollars ain't no chicken feed, but sure, I can help you out. That's very kind. 
What is your name, sir? Arthur Morgan. Your donation will be acknowledged on a founder's plaque when the building is completed. You have a great day, Mr. Morgan. All right, well, I'm gonna go. I'm glad I can stop by for that. Now I'm 20 bucks poorer. No choice but to do that pounty poster. I finally find this friggin' town, and there's not a whole lot I can do! Stupid! Paco Hernandez. Albert Mason. Well, I better enjoy myself before I go off and frickin'. Oh, I was gonna. Hello, how are you today? Hello, madam. Well, good luck to you. Seems a worthwhile cause. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Thank you. Where's my horse? You are not too far away to come see me. Yeah, you better get your butt over here. What are you afraid of? Yeah, that's your boy. So warped up. There, boy. Out of the damn way. Right there, face the law. Screw the out of you. Shit, no. You ain't gonna walk out of this town alive. Come on, please. I didn't take much. Okay, well. I don't want to be a part of that. <coughs> oh, you sorry son of a bitch. What do we have here? The idiot club? <laughs> Sing to you. You morons must be founder members. What do you All want? All right, calm it. I'm only rattling your cage. Yeah, okay, boy. All right, boy. Here, yeah, okay, boy. What are you? Hey, boy. Mangy blue chick coon hound. Alright, boy. Slaughterhound down! Oh my God, you're in the middle of the street. Only be a second. Welcome, sir. Oops. Come in and have a browse. Now let's have a look. Nito. Oh, he's got flies. That's what it is. Owned. Owned. Excellent choice. Oh, yeah, whatever. Shut up. I need you to stifle my creativity. <gasps> I want it, but I can't afford it. Take one of those. Boom. That is nice. Very nice. I really appreciate it. Enjoy your business. Thank you. Andiamo. How do you do, sir? Friggin' map. Well, I don't 
care about any of you people. Ah, please, thank you. Where is that? Oh my god, that is the second time you've been in the mode. Yeah. Hello. Hey, mister. Right. Hold to the right, please. Slower vehicles to the right. Of course. Welcome to my shop. We won't uh, worry about how sketchy your shop is. Fine, sure. Wow me. Stock provisions. What can I give you? Can I give you everything? Chocolate bar, sock. Shit that I can get later in the game again. Oh, you, you don't want it. Oh, you're so stingy. Hmm. Always thinking of yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm always thinking of myself. I don't want your sheet. I won't ask where it came from. Yeah, you. I know you won't. Whoever gave this to you was very nice. <laughs> yeah, gave. <laughs> That's funny. What is this? Uh, Real but, good doing business with you. Oh, actually, I want to know what you have. I have quite the skills, if you have the right ingredients. But, wait, one more thing. Uh, no. You're kind of sketchy. Like saying that to a guy that I just sold a bunch of my stolen crap to, but. Madam, back here. Seems like they hold. How many are you today? Cuidado. Hey, y'all. Welcome back. Howdy. Oh, what do you have? Hmm, actually, I saw. Uh, I don't want you to get. I don't want to give you my gun oil. makes the hardiest clothes around. Don't doubt it. A bear hunter. I have to go get a perfect bison pelt, huh? Perfect bull hide. Oh, I want to make a bear out of his punk ass. What is this? Legendary beaver, boar, and cardinal. One-of-a-kind pelts make one-of-a-kind garments. Worth the legwork, I assure you. Crikey! The death row! 
Legendary alligator skin, perfect snake skin. Legendary alligator skin. Oh, that's nice. I've run this the ghost bison. The from here to the border, the northern border, that is, and I've never been out of work. What is that? That is a cool hat. Perfect coyote pelt, huh? You can get two of those. No problem. Duchess hat. Here there's some queer folk at that pig farm. Dakota, tall trees, big valley, Roanoke. I run this stall just about everywhere. Best way to source the skins. I've run this stall all the way from here to the border. The northern border, that is. And I've never been out of work. Oh, that's doing the challenges. Hello, sir. Thanks. Someone to get rid of them for me. I'll pay very well. I just need. All right, calm down. Let me see what I can do. Oh, thank God. Just be sure not to bang around the place too much. I'll wait out here. Oh, I do have my varmint rifle. Sweet.
they picked that one up. One right up my fucking head right there. Things carry diseases and I'm just picking them up with my bare hands. What are you doing? There's still some in there. No, there's not. Shut up. Hello. How you doing? Ooh, thanks, mister. Take this. Ooh, you earned every cent. I killed worse. 1339. You kidding me? Unbelievable. Some people have no dignity. Photo Studio. Located in St. Dennis's historic old quarter, St. Francis, the studio is. Graphic innovation that can produce personal portraits. Oh, what was I gonna do? Ay, 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 cabrón. If you hurry, we can still use the room. As well as can be expected. Good evening. Bonjour, chérie. Morning. Morning should be good. Bonjour, monsieur. Mister. Bien le bonjour, monsieur. Be careful. Uh, partner? Morning to you, sir. Hard to imagine in five minutes, if I walk from here, you see houses don't even have lights. You know, in. when you have one of those days. That's so. Oh, I think I'm drunk. Morning to you. Mais quelle délicieuse surprise! You should be careful who you speak to around here. Oh. Watch where you're going. Excuse me. Right here. 
have to walk in? I think I have to walk in. Well, you're not here to turn yourself in, so I conclude you're a bounty hunter. May I direct you to the poster on the wall there? Okay, Chief. What's this? Inspect the poster. One hundred dollar reward. Captured dead or alive of Lindsay Warford. Warford. You All right. after Lindsay Warford. I might be. Or I might just wanna hang his poster up on my wall. Yeah, they're a bad lot, the Lamone Raiders. Stupid fellas won't leave good enough alone. One of these days, mm. the government's gonna get sick of private militias, you know. One of these days, the government's gonna get sick of all of us. Don't tell them I said that. The bounty. Why are you making this feather someone else's problem? We, sir, are an urban police force. And the Raiders are, well, mostly a rural nuisance. My men simply are not suited for this kind of work. Okay. This feller in particular, Wofford, ain't it? Why him? You cut off the head, the body died. That's the hypothesis, at least. We shall see if it can be demonstrated with the Lamoin Raiders. If the bounty's for this okay. whole outfit, you should have made it more. Guess all that remains is to bring him in. Remember, they forfeited their right to life as well as limited. Let's go, boy. <laughs> Oh my god. Way the hell up there. Should charge more. Yeah, good boy. Man, I've only been in this town for a short time and I already hate it!
after. Blue water marsh, Lemoy. up there. Oh. Can I get in through here? Yes, but the game says no.
hang out there for a minute. Gotta check the books. Died for 67 cents, are you kidding me? <gasps> Told you I'd pick up more snake oil. No, it's a dead guy. Look at that. Okay, boy. Yeah. My little pony, my little pony. Hey, 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 kid, you want to see a dead body? Everybody comment. Come on, everybody comment. Say something about them. Say Yeah, see that? It's a dead body. So I guess you might want to leave me alone. I believe this body's worth something. Well now, so much for them boys being the terror of the South. <laughs> Drop that raid in the cart out back. Come around for your bounty. <clears throat> I 
I make good on my promises. Here's your payment. I'm worth every penny. I got six minutes to go off and die. Do this mission next. It's my attention now. So don't do anything you'll regret. Oh, shut up. Something the matter? trouble just passing through you look like you might need a few smacks to set you straight <sighs> you threatening me you piss ant stupid bastard's got a problem with authority <laughs> good lord you up against real men Again, you You're gonna die in a lot. I guess I was told. <laughs> I've lost my friend. How do you do, sir? Somebody hey, folks. Help me, please. Oh. Hello, sir. Uh, listen, have you seen... I'm looking for my friend, Gavin. I don't know any Gavins, I'm afraid. English bloke. Mm -hmm. Lovely fella. He went missing, and uh, now I'm all alone. Good luck. That's, uh, that's too bad.
Dragon! His name was Larry, I'd help you find him. <laughs> Get it, because Larry is a name. Bad things. Hey, mister. Will you give me some money? Sure. Well, thank you. Say, say, where you from? Around. <laughs> Ain't from right here. If I was you, I'd leave. This town lost its goddamn soul a long time ago. <laughs> Nothing but nasty, miserable people. Yeah? Yeah, ever since them, them greys moved here. They a bunch of no-good white trash. Yeah, they, they somehow got rich. About 50 years ago, they moved here because of a whole heap of trouble. Yeah, they reckon they was, reckon they was Yankee spies during the war and everything. That's so. Yeah, sure. Hello, sir. Okay, boy. <laughs> Wait your turn. Almost done. How do you do? Back so soon? Hey, you there. A quick word. What can I do for you, sir? There's an old gunslinger mm -hmm. I'm looking for. I heard he comes through here. Name of Midnight Billy. Oh, that old soak? Yeah, he spends days on board these trains, but he's going nowhere but the gutter. I imagine you'll find him right in the next one through here. Either that or the next one. Try them both. Look in the bar car. I suppose. Oh, oh should have waited for that to stop on. Belly man not. And I belly man not. You're barely midnight. Mr. Midnight? Excuse me, I'm trying to drink. Mr. Midnight. Barely midnight. This won't take a moment. I just want to talk with you about your old days as a shootist. Get away from me! Whoa. Hey. I didn't shoot him in his sleep. Whoa. No one's I saying didn't shoot him that. In sleep, one second. Nope. I did, it was the only way. Not a problem. I'm here about Jim Boy Calloway, and no one shot him yet. I knew you'd come for me! Get away from me! Mr. Midnight! Uh. I knew you'd come! But you ain't getting me! You ain't! I knew you'd come! Alright, let's see how many times I can fucking fail this. That's one! <sighs> I think I'm getting the hang of it. But my horse is now on my fucking... on the train with me. That's two! Load the checkpoint.
as us do. Auto save. Fundraiser. How long ago was that? Uh, no. Whatever. Billy Mid, I died. Get to my fucking camera. I think it'd be pretty cool. Damn it. Sorry, bud. Come on, let's get the fuck out of here. I don't know how you got on that train. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's going back to St. Daniels. Yeah, yeah. I'm ignorant. Y'all ignorant. Stop it. Ignorant. What's next? Oh. What's this? Emmett Granger. Damn it, Granger! I'm coming for you! through don't mean to intrude on your politics we're gonna catch all kinds of hell from sheriff over this this feud's getting worse not better we need to settle this soon once and for all come on let's get out of here yeah Whoa, that's a dog I haven't expected yet. Beagle! Oh, American Fox Hand. Hello, boy. A good dog. I'm going! Fucking barking at me. It barked at all the time at work.
Come here, fox. I need to study. Oh, I already fucking. I shift from a horse. Horse survivor. Open horse stamina. Full resources. Horse stamina. Full health. Brush. Oh, I'm not wearing my bear hat. Oh, yeah, I am. Yeah, I'm wearing my bear hat. I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. Ah, oh, sorry, boy. I am such a... I am an awful human being. Come on, boy. I am an awful human being. I'm so sorry. I didn't see that cliff there. It came out of nowhere. Take me forever to get over there so I can scoop cow shit. Oh, my, na my name's Arthur, or, you know, Game Boy, but, you know, you feel it necessary to thank you. You saved my life. I owe you. Got that right. I do. Oh. Oh. Now, I, I gotta get out of here. No! Oh. 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 Don't much like it around here no more. Glad I could help. Keep your eyes on the ground, huh? Hey, 
You. What do you want? Howdy. You Granger? That's my name. And my occupation, too, if you hadn't noticed. Weren't always like that, though, were you? Used to be a quick draw guy. You knew Jim Boy Calloway? Used to be's correct. Then days are long over. And who might you be? Don't matter. I need you to tell me about Jim Boy. Just a quote for a book. A book about Jim Boy? <laughs> a book. Well, shit. I can't talk to you now. Shit. Look at me. A knee deep in hog crap. Well, don't mind me. We can talk while you work. <laughs> I ain't talking and shoveling. Besides, a young man like you get it done in half the time. I don't know about that. What's to know? You interested in the old days? If you shovel this shit, I tell you some stories. You keep your hands clean, I don't give you squat. God damn it. He's better God than these damn it, I got stories. It. Oh, they are. Pick up the fork and get to work. Or get out of here and stop wasting my time. All right. Shovel your big damn big shit. shit. Jim Boy weren't nothing, you know. Me? I killed men, women, and children, too. Animals? I even killed rocks. And I killed them good. I shot folks, stabbed folks, skinned folks. I scalped some. <laughs> Boy, they scream when you scalp them. Hey, let me work. Don't know what's got into these odds, but I know what's coming out of them. <laughs> I bash folks, butchered folks. I burn folks alive. Buried folks alive. One time, I... Hey, I get it, all right? You're me. What about Callaway? Now it's clean enough to eat off. Uh, I guess I'm done. You get that barrel to the shit pile, and I suppose you is. All right. No shortage of shit round here. Comes from hungry hogs and no hands. Uh, uh, hell, uh, that stinks. <laughs> okay, I cleaned up your mask. Go on. Tell me about Callaway. I said I'd tell you stories. I didn't say they'd be about him. Don't trifle with me, old man. You knew him. Just give me something, anything. You're making a book, you should make it about me. They're just words, is all. Give me something to say and I'll leave you alone. You owe me that. Hey, you be careful. <sighs> Killer like me, it don't take much to end up on the end of my knife. One hey, time... You know I... what? I don't think you were anything at all. Just a crazy old man. I ain't a killer? Well, you'd already be hog feed. I hadn't made a deal with the Federals got this far. This is your last chance, Mr. Granger. Give me a quote for the book. Hey, hey, hey you don't you don't hit no man of peace, no government witness. <laughs> Callaway said you was full of piss, but he didn't tell me the half of it. I'm itching to drop you, girlie. Only you ain't worth my time. I, I got too much to lose. Too much to lose? Well, seeing as I cleaned up this pig's die, I figure I'm in my rights to wreck it. Let's see. You don't want to do that? You walk away right now. Well, well. All I wanted was a quote. You don't know who you're trifling with. That's my stick! You walk away. No. No. No! You didn't know! Took yourself a regular shit shower, Mr. Granger. Boy, mm. that's real nasty. Mm -mm -mm. You earned yourself a killing. And I'm gonna enjoy it now. Draw. It's gonna be the last thing you do. Probably.
Oh, damn it. to home. Let's go, boy. Yep. I have to stand there. Hi, Karen. Arthur, covered in blood. Driscoll boy. Arthur, that's a strange getup. What you up to? Just minding my own business. Okay, keep it that way. Yeah, good talking to you. Hey, Jack. into my crafting at the moment, Mr. Morgan. I'm very happy to make you something if you bring me the right materials. Thanks, Mr. Pearson. received anything from you in a while, Mr. Morgan. I will. Thank you, Arthur.
I went to Oil City for her in oil. Oh, my world traveling and roaming. Around. I spy the fair maiden so lovely. And gently stir I did say, well, let me ride your ring dang do. <laughs> She pulled up her garment so scared it would soil. I out with old Phoenix went boring for oil. I hadn't been boring six inches or more when the oil from my auger so freely did pour. She wiggled her ass and looked up and smiled and said, Bear down on your auger, for I know you struck oil. Things went on and on for a week or ten days. My auger machinery got to fire in some way. You busy, Arthur? John? Let's get on. Good. And you? Got everything we need. Good. I think we need another man. Charles? I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. Sure. See you, Arthur? Ain't that dumb. <laughs> Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. Then you'll be a genius. I heard about a house. It could be interesting. What kind of a house? I don't know. A couple fellas I heard in town, they said... said it was really freakish. A family local boogeyman, I guess. But they're crooked in every way. So? Well, so these boys thought they were sitting on a lot of cash. And they're highway robbers, kidnappers, apparently. But they're well hidden in the woods. Well, sounds pretty dubious. Of course, uh, yeah, it's dubious, but there ain't much risk of getting caught. Okay, then. Let's go take a look. Exactly. Just take a look. It's up north, on the other side of the river from Valentine. Best way there is through Cumberland Falls, though. You know it? Sure, more or less. Now, let's stop and go on foot from here. Hang on, I gotta change my outfit. Just up the hill this way. Follow me. So wait, I kept it. There's a spot up ahead where you should be able to get a good look at the place. <laughs> <laughs> 
I want to make sure we don't run into any surprises. Sure. Apparently, this family's been isolated for so long, they started talking in their own weird dialect. They really don't like outsiders, especially on their turf. <sighs> well, you just keep selling me on this job, don't you? barn in the back. It's not a bad place to start looking. There must be a lot of people living here. A large house. Stash could be in any one of them buildings. And who knows how many people are in there. <clears throat> I ain't sure about this. Boy, I, I think we need to draw them out somehow. And I got an idea. Follow me. All these trees, I can't get a proper look at the place. Well, hopefully it'll make it harder for them to spot us, too. Coast seems clear so far. Yeah, so far. Hey, keep it down. I hear voices. behind this shed. See if we can hear what they're saying. Stay low, Arthur. Just stay quiet. Where you been now, Newt? Don't be boiling now, Pappy. I's gone but ten minutes I was. Gag all the now day long, cause Edie takes patrol now, don't you? What? No, oh, Edie, get all the jam. You shut your gulper, or I'll flag her your felt, I will. Your niece will pull it up, boy. Up. Go guard the shed. Go! You understand what they're saying? Not much of it. What are we doing, Javier? Okay. I take cover by the rock over there. I'll create a little distraction, and then you jump them, okay? What kind of distraction? You'll see.
place else I could store it. You got it. Oh, well, look what we have here. I told you it was worth the trouble, didn't I? Yeah, you take this. Let's split up. I'll meet you back at camp. Right, sounds good. Good girl. <laughs> 